Stargazers across Europe have been enjoying the large pink supermoon. Although it's called this, astronomers have said there's no difference in colour. The best time to see this moon in the UK will be at around 4am tonight. For many stargazers, this is an event they don't want to miss. These supermoons appear much larger than usual, and have over the years produced some incredible photographs. During these events, the moon is sometimes closer to our planet, which makes it look much larger than it normally is. One NASA scientist said this pink supermoon will be 17,000 miles or 27,000 kilometers closer to us than average. Due to so many cameras being pointed at the moon, we got some really good photos from various locations across Europe. However, some people did manage to capture things they didn't expect. This is what happened to one woman who sent us the following photographs. She said the following, I was out with my son taking photographs of the moon when I snapped this picture. We were using his telescope that we got him for his birthday, which is a Dobsonian telescope 8 inch. It's great and picks up on the moon really well. After staying out for 30 minutes or so, we decided to head back home. It wasn't until I was looking through the photographs that I noticed something strange. I certainly didn't see this during the time and I have no idea what to make of it. Whatever it is, it looks like a giant V. I've never seen anything like this before. The woman went on to say that whatever it is, it only appeared in one photograph. On first looking at the object, it does appear to be triangular or V-shaped. This unidentified object, however, could be a variety of things. For example, it could be a satellite or some other type of space debris that just so happened to be passing by the moon. Astronomers have said the space above our planet is littered with various materials that humans have built. A study in 2013 said there's over 170 million bits of debris outside of our Earth that's smaller than one centimeter. There's over 670,000 pieces of debris between one and 10 centimeters, and around 29,000 larger pieces were estimated to be in orbit around the Earth. It's important to note that these objects will fall back to Earth sometime in the future. NASA have said there's around 3,000 human-made satellites in working order around the Earth. However, if the debris of old and damaged satellites are taken into account, the number increases dramatically. Astronauts have reported that every so often they'll see fast objects fly by the International Space Station, and that some of these do look strange when zipping past. Glowing orbs and other strange things have been seen outside of the space station. However, NASA have said that most of these can be explained, and they turn out to be normal space debris. The question is, would this have been picked up on? I'm interested to hear your guys' opinions on what this object could be. Do you think this is a man-made satellite or something completely different? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.